Hello, welcome to our weekly Tai Chi. Today we'll be covering clothes and seal. Last time we covered chop through mountain or fanning back. So today I will show you how to connect from chop through mountain all the way until clothes and seal. We'll be actually having some moves that we've covered before. So we will not be practicing those. So I'll just show how we link them up. So last time we covered from pick up meter from bottom of C to chop to mountain. So from chop to mountain, you shift to the right, to the left, and you do flip body strike. And we've uh, covered flip body strike already. And from flip body strike, you shift back and you do parry or brush and punch. And you do punch to the corner. And from punch to the corner, you keep turning your waist. And you turn your waist over your left hand and then you shift back and you push. This move here is called close and seal. So again, now this time, starting from fanning back, you shift to your right, and then you turn your waist, your arms, as you can see, move with them. You shift back, and you center yourself. You step out at an angle, you shift, and you flip, body strike, shift back, parry, and punch. And from parry and punch to the corner, you close, And now, from the back, shift forward, And now the application. Joe, if you would do the honors. Absolutely. Thank you. So, keep the distance, please. Thank you. Okay, so now, um, as you see, the move is actually punch, and this is uh, close and seal. And as you can probably imagine, what happens is, is that I'm coming in to punch Joe. And Joe, let's say, for instance, does a block with his hand. Uh, where he's just pushing his hand apart this way and all you're really doing is you're actually moving this away and then watch this and as you can see this is already uh, taking him apart and then all you gotta do is you can you gotta step in and uh, push him away um, now this has a lot of different variations you can be caught with this hand you can be caught with this hand where basically from here you can just come in this way and it's the same, it's the same way when you step in with this leg or with this leg but essentially from here um, it has the same effect. Now sometimes um, you can actually use this for uh, a slightly different kind of um, application where when you punch sometimes the person will block this way and so when you come in and yes watch this so as the person is blocking, it just is a parry, and then you get a full arm, and you can push on the arm, uh, or you can actually go this way, and then actually attack again. And so from here, 
as he's pushing away, coming in here, or coming in here, and then um, pushing. And it's called close and seal because as you're punching, watch this, you close and then you seal it. Typically, it's actually used on the arm. So this is considered to be a door. And so when he's blocking and then I seal it up, I close up his gateway. And so since I close up his gateway and then from here, if I push, then I seal the deal. So there will be enough application for today. Thank you very much. Uh, and for practice, um, I'll be leading facing this way so you can follow along. Again, you shift this way, shift back, you let your arms comfortably hang, you shift forward, and you turn. just go fanning back here and then you can actually repeat the whole sequence in the same manner. That will be it for today. Enjoy.